Hey guys, Zuzu Natural here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me. I wanted to do a summer favorites for you guys. I love summer favorites because it lets you know what I've been using and what I'm feeling and digging this summer. And I have quite a few things that I have. Um, not a lot. I've really cut down on my purchasing of products. I really kind of stick to what I really enjoy and like. I haven't been trying as many new things, so I don't have a ton of things for you. But I do have a few things for you. So if you want to see what I have on my summer favorites list, stay tuned. Yeah. going to talk about is these deodorants. These deodorants, guys, these were on my summer favorites last year. The reason why they are on my summer favorites again is because I want you to realize how important it is that I have found the one, okay? The Neo, the one when it comes to natural deodorant. I have searched high and low and near and far for a natural deodorant that will work for me all year long, long, including when it's 100 degrees outside and 110 degrees outside, because that's when it's most important. Who cares in the winter when you don't even need anything and you're not going to get funky? It's a big deal in the summer. So I'm no longer in Houston. I'm in New York City. We have had some record-breaking heat lately. Like, we have had some really treacherous days. But in general, it's not as hot as Houston. I don't think anything is as hot as Houston. But um, we've had some 100-degree days. Like, it's just like, what? What? I did not move here for this? Mm -mm. But guess what? I stay fresh through those days because I have this Zion Health Deodorant Clay Dry. My favorite is the... <laughs> Grab the wrong one. That's not my favorite. The fav my favorite is the Sweet Amber. I love it. Uh, I also love the Cedarwood. This one is more of a masculine scent. I do kind of like masculine musky scents like um, patchouli and cedarwood and, and, and musk. I love those scents. But um, this is a sweet one. So if you want more of a feminine, you might want to try this. I love these. They are made with baking soda. I do have baking soda sensitivities. These do not bother me one bit, so I don't think it has a lot of baking soda, like the Primal Pit Paste or the Schmitz, which kind of rub me the wrong way under the pits, even though they do keep you fresh. Uh, but it doesn't matter if your underarms are a little irritated, right? And after continued use, I've just had irritated underarms from those. But I've been using these for a very long time now, and I don't. I'll drop a uh, code down below, it'll give you 30% off of your first order with the Diamond Minerals for the Zion Health uh, deodorants. I don't see anything from that. I don't get anything from that. I'm just trying to hook y'all up so you can have fresh underarms. So take advantage of that if you haven't used it. They have some sets now where you can get, um, they're $7.99. Okay, they're $7.99 a piece, which is an excellent price for a natural deodorant because I've paid up to $14 and $15 for a natural deodorant. But they have a set now where you can get a large one and then a small travel size, which comes in handy for throwing in your purse for it to stay fresh throughout the day, which you won't need. I don't refresh on this, but putting in maybe for the gym or when you're traveling. And so it comes with a large one and a small one, and I think it's $10. So that's an excellent price right there. And so... This is my summer essential. One of my summer favorites. Zion Health Clay Dry Deodorant. I love it. These next two products I'm going to do together because they're from the same company. And the company is Floor and B. Floor and B. And these products were sent to me. I just want to say that. But that does not mean because they were sent to me that I have to love them, right? Because they sent me a bunch of products. And these are the two that I love. The other two are okay. They're all right. They're fine. I don't have any issues with them. But I'm not like, woo, I love them. These two I absolutely love and adore and will purchase myself. So one of the claims to fame for Floor and B is that all their products are under $30. So... The Nectar of the Sea is uh, $28, and this is a vitamin C serum. I love it. It has a gel-like texture, and it just, you get this dropper, and it has a gel-like texture that is so light, 
and just absorbs into the skin. I love it. It smells good. It has wonderful ingredients, non-toxic ingredients, no nasties. So that's another of their claims to fame. They also donate to charity, which is wonderful. I believe they donate 1% of their proceeds to charity. Wonderful, wonderful natural ingredients, no nasty toxins. So that's the nectar of the sea. I use this after I have cleansed, uh, put on my eye serum, and spritzed my face with my toner. I put this on right before I do my moisturizer. The other product that is my favorite, or my summer favorites, is their Eyes Eyes Baby. It's an anti-aging eye cream. And so I put my eye serum on from Lotus Moon first, and then I put the eye cream on after, right before I do my moisturizer. And I love this eye cream. I love this eye cream. And I had kind of strayed away from eye creams just because I was like, do I really need the serum and the cream? Yeah, I do. I do. And eye cream really helps keep that under eye area really moisturized so it doesn't crack and dry out and have wrinkles and all of that. Even though, you know, we don't really wrinkle that much. I think that uh, melanated skin does more of a sagging than wrinkle. And so this is what it looks like. It smells really good. I can't really explain the smell. It just smells good. Very kind of natural, essential, oily smell, I guess. And uh, what I love is the texture of this as well. So that's one of the things that I love about the other. But the texture is really, really light. That's the texture you just need a little bit. And look when I put it on. Like, look how it just rubs in. It just rubs in. And you don't have any greasy or oily under eye, which I don't like. I don't like a greasy or oily cream under my eye because I just don't like the way it looks. And so this is so beautiful. That's the Eyes Eyes Baby. And of course, natural ingredients. No nasty toxins. Love this company. Floor and B. Love them. Next up, we have the Pacifica Alight Foundation. Man, this foundation for me has been a game changer. So natural foundations can get quite pricey. You guys know I love my Plain Jane Beauty. I do, always will, always have. Uh, Plain Jane Beauty Foundation is pretty much in line with what a natural green beauty foundation will cost you. But Pacifica has changed the game with coming out with a Green Beauty Foundation that is $16. So most Green Beauty Foundations will cost you between high 30s to high 50s. So some someplace in between like $38 to $58 for a Green Beauty Foundation. And I've gladly paid it in the past. I have, but I really don't want to pay that much. I just don't. I don't want to pay that much. Not if I don't have to. So I decided I needed to try this. They have a lot of colors. And what I'll do is do a standalone video for this to give you the specifics on this product. But right now, I just want to tell you that I love it. Okay. I am in 10 warm tan. That's my color. It's my summer color. The first time I ever purchased this, I purchased it in the winter moving into the spring. So the temperature was very cold still in the city and I was much lighter, several shades lighter. And I believe I purchased 15 warm tan. But as soon as we had like that first spring day where the sun was out and I got a little darker because I get darker fast. As soon as that sun hits me, my skin starts going shades, okay, shades. And so as soon as that sun hit me, I couldn't use that anymore and I ran out to get a darker shade. And this is the color that worked perfect for me. They have a lot of shades that are in this range. So you really want to go test this out because you're probably going to get it wrong if you don't. But um, I really like it. So I'll do a video for you guys showing you exactly uh, what this looks like and tell you more about it. But it's a summer fave and it's $16. Pacifica Alight Clean Foundation. I am in 10 Warm Tan. Next up, we have some more makeup. So now this has been in my quest to find an affordable mascara. It's Physician's Formula, so it's not the most green product on the planet. We know that. Uh, however, it is a better option to some of the conventional options and it you can find it at the drugstore which I love and with like with the last product the Pacifica you can find that at Target. Target has an amazing green beauty section now. It is growing and growing. You can find it at Ulta. And so 
lately I've just really been wanting to purchase products that I can just run to the store and get because I don't always feel like going online and ordering and waiting for them and paying shipping. I just don't always feel like that. So I tried this physician's formula. This is the Argan Oil, Argan Wear Mascara. Look at this container. It is so cute. It's like Aladdin. <laughs> it's an Aladdin mascara. Like, I love it. It's so pretty. Uh, but um, it was like a little palace, right? And I love it. I love this. It smells good. It smells like Argan Oil to me. I've heard people say it has a chemical smell. And I'm like, no, that's Argan Oil. What are you talking about? So it smells like Argan Oil. I like the brush. Uh, let's see. That's the brush. The brush is really nice. And I like the formula. It doesn't bleed or leak or give me like panda eye. It gives me um, a little lengthening and a little bit of uh, volume. Not a lot, not a lot, okay? But a little bit of volume, mainly lengthening. And it lasts all day. It's really, really dark. This, I believe, is like the true ultra black, ultra black. It's affordable. It's under $10. I think it's $7.99. You can find it at the drugstore. You can find it at Target. You can get it online on Amazon. And so it's very easy and readily available, which is why I like it. And a lot of the natural mascaras, like true blue green beauty mascaras that I had been using are, first of all, expensive. So one of my favorites was the Well People. And I think the Well People is what, 20 some dollars. And I really just don't want to spend 20 some dollars on mascara anymore. I just don't want to. And uh, with the Well People, it would give a little bleeding. So I wouldn't use it on my bottom. I would just use it on the top. And it did a nice separating and lengthening. And this does the same. So this is what I've been using. It's a summer favorite. If you are a true blue diehard green beauty fan, this may not be for you. But that's up to you to decide. But I love it. More makeup. More makeup. And so the color that I'm wearing right now is this color. And this is from Red Apple Lipsticks. This is part of their new summer collection. And it is Red Apple Red. It is the bomb. I love my reds. I have been so, like, I never used to be a fan of red lipstick. I always preferred something that was a little more subdued, a little more, a little less loud, something more natural. So, like, their Gypsy Soul, which is kind of like a brown color, was always my favorite. But, like, I am such a red girl now. Like, I put red on for everything. I don't care if I'm going to do yoga. I have my red lipstick on, okay? I don't care. I love it. And so, this is Red Apple Red. It's so pretty. Look at that. It's a little melty because it's been so hot. But I'm wearing that right now. It's rushing that up. So you can see it. It's a beautiful, bright, kind of classic red. Kind of has that um, tomato-y look to it. And so prior to getting this one, I was using Ravishing, which was part of Red Apple Lipstick's Winter Collection, which is a much darker winter red, not your classic red. Has more of a um, dark red color. I still love that color, okay? I just feel like it's so wearable. Such an everyday red. This red to me is just slightly fancier because it's brighter. That's all. But I love my red, so I don't care. I like them both. I wish I should have brought that color down so I could swatch both of them next to each other. But it's a much darker red. And this is your classic bright, sexy red. And I love it. I've been wearing it every day since I got it. I wish I had come on here and showed you this before the collection launch, but I was sick. And this is my first time being able to get to it. So here it is. It is beautiful. Red Apple Red. I love it. I will be wearing this until it's gone, okay? And then I will purchase another one and wear that until it's gone. I love it. This is my last item. So it's not a beauty product or anything like that. It's food. It's food. Well, it's hibiscus flowers. It's flowers. And it's uh, from Feel Good Organics. It's not sponsored or anything. I just love it. Uh, and it's organic hibiscus flowers, uh, raw from Egypt, certified organic. Listen, this is a game changer right here. I know I said some other things are game changers. This is a game changer. So a little while ago, my mom was saying that she was having high blood pressure. And so I started looking up things. I was talking to my honey, and he's very knowledgeable on health and wellness and he was like she should have some hibiscus tea she has some hibiscus tea so my mom actually is the one that found this brand hibiscus tea and she gets it off of amazon i purchased it off of amazon as well this is the pound which is like 14.99 but originally i purchased the uh half a pound which is 9.99 this is a better price because you get double the amount for you know not double the cost but um 
This is beautiful. These hibiscus flowers are so strong and fragrant and powerful. For those of you who don't know about hibiscus, it's packed with antioxidants. It helps with liver functions. It helps lower blood pressure. It helps with, um, it has compounds that are anti-cancerous, so it helps fight against cancer. It is just a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful flower. And so it's like, let food be thy medicine. That's what it's about when it comes to this. So when I got real serious about this was when my mom was like, she first tried it and it was just, you know, I just told her about it. I wasn't really thinking anything else about it. So she went out and bought it because my mom does not play. She's like, hibiscus flowers, I'm on it. So she went out and got it and she started drinking it. And within about a month, she was taking her blood pressure and looking at the numbers. And she was like, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. So she snapped, screenshotted them and showed me to him. And I was like, oh my gosh. So it's one thing to read about a product that says it can do this. It's another thing to actually see it right? To see it in the flesh that this really does lower blood pressure. So my mom's blood pressure has come all the way down, okay? All the way down. And hers wasn't crazy high or anything. It was just higher than she would have liked it to be. And so I make this for my dad so he can have great blood pressure. I make this for myself, like preventive maintenance. I love it. It tastes delicious. All I do is steep the flowers in um, boiling water, and I strain them because it is a loose blend. It's loose. So I, I strain them, use a strainer. Um, I put some raw, unfiltered honey in. I put some organic ginger juice in. It is the most amazing thing. I have uh, had it hot, but I prefer it cold as an iced tea. And we keep this as a staple in the refrigerator. This is our drink of choice. So you know how people have like iced teas and things in the fridge that they sip on? This is what we sip on. This is what we sip on. So let food be thy medicine. This is my last favorite for the summer. This is my last summer essential favorites for 2019. Must have. So that's it. Like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good jazz. Do you like any of my favorites or any of my favorites? Your favorites? Let me know in the comments. Drop it in the comments. What are some of your favorites? Drop that in the comments. Do you drink hibiscus tea? I must know. Drop that in the comments. Uh, yeah, so that's it. Like, share, comment, subscribe. All that good jazz. Zuzu Natural. Peace out.